And hi, guys. Hello. Hi. A uh, big, big, big congrats on together. It's devastatingly funny or comically devastating. <laughs> Yet it's oh, hopeful. Hopeful, quite brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Actually, actually. Thank you. Let's begin with you, Miss Sharon. Nice to see you again. When you heard what the film would be about with a fantastic script by Dennis Kelly, what did you think? Uh, I, I was just very um, thrilled that they asked me to do it or that Dennis wanted me to do it. You know, um, it, it's rare that you get handed something that um, is so brilliant with so many great people attached to it and and telling, um, telling a, a story in a way that I, I don't think I've seen told before. And um, yeah, I was just extremely happy and felt like a very lucky girl, like I did all the way through it. Oh, and you, Mr. James, nice to see you again as well. Let's talk about the fourth wall, you know, that wall between the audience and the actor, uh, actors, and it means broken here. So when director Stephen Daldry told you about it, what did you think? Oh, man, I mean, it was very, very... I love doing that. That's one of my favorite kinds of acting. Look, man, the most compelling experiences in life can just be you having a conversation with somebody else, looking into their eyes, looking into their face. So getting to do that with the audience you have the potential to make it really compelling and really exciting as well. Uh, we're just not used to seeing it in film but uh, as much, but it doesn't mean it can't live on film. And I think it works really well in this one. Exactly. You know, uh, to be honest, I mean, it felt kind of off-putting in the beginning, maybe the first five minutes. Then I got into it and then I was like, oh, it makes sense. It's like video blogging that got became famous during the pandemic, right? I mean, you're, you're kind of like talking to us. <laughs> Yeah, we're talking definitely. to you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, Miss Sharon, talk to us about the dynamics between the couple. I mean, there's love there, there's hate as well, and then there's love again, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, it's sort of um, it, it, it's 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 a loveless hate and a hate filled <laughs> love. You know, uh, it's sort of it's 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 a sort of fluctuating thing as well. You know. Um, and I, and I think it, it goes to a really unexpected place. And and in the end, I found it really deeply romantic. Um, I, I, I um, told Dennis when I read it first that I, I'm just not used to him, you know, ending anything sort of happily. And I know, you know, it, it's it's um, it, it was complex and you don't know exactly what's going to happen to them, which I which I also love. But it did end in a in a, in a hopeful sort of romantic love-filled way which and um, i cried mr james he is conservative she is sort of liberal yet it's not political though isn't it i mean i find it kind of brilliant yeah no i think it's um you know our our politics and our leanings are part of our relationships they're part of our lives and not everybody ends up with somebody who has opposing views and most of us don't i guess I don't know, but uh, it's not my experience. I've usually ended up with somebody who's aligned with what I feel. But um, but uh, what an interesting thing to live through when you're trapped in a house and somebody's got the, the opposing views. And look, in a world that is so split, it is so divided and on everything, it seems, that's fine. That's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. The problem is when we as a species can't seem to agree to disagree or or use our prime human attribute of empathy to be able to try and understand and imagine what the other person's going through. But um, that's what these two are going through. So it's a little microcosm with a microcosm. Oh, a big congrats and together again. It comes out in theaters August 27th and everyone should see it. And real quick, great script, direction, acting, quoting the movie. I'm saying this under the banner of rigorous honesty. Wait. Oh, I love it. Thanks, Meg. <laughs> Bye, guys. Good luck. Bye. <laughs>